Hi, you guys. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. I am getting ready. I was going to say getting late. Getting ready way later, way later than I thought I would be today. But we're here and we've made it. So we're going to finally put some makeup on my face. I like this. I don't even know what's happening. Don't even know what's happening. Um, but make sure you say hello whenever you hop on. Let me know you're here. Hit the share button. Y'all know the drill. Um, it's been a whirlwind of a morning, you guys. Hey, Bertina. Make sure y'all say hello when you hop on. Um, it has been a whirlwind of a morning. So, I'm glad to be sitting down. I'm already exhausted. <laughs> so, I am. Um, hey, Bridget. Hey, Tracy. Hi, guys. Um, I am just like, we're going to make some fizz. I need some energy back in my life. Like, so bad. Hey, Tanya. Welcome, guys. Make sure you guys say hello. Hit the share button. Y'all know the drill. How many times can I say that? Am I annoying yet? Probably. Um, all right. Let me get this shared myself really quick. We're going to make some fizz. So, y'all know this is my, like, the whole reason I can stay alive and have energy throughout the day. So, this is mango peach. This isn't available anymore. Please don't come for me. But this is 55 milligrams of naturally dried caffeine from green tea. And this is the mango peach flavor. Um, blood orange is my favorite flavor out of the core flavors. But I always mix mine with a LaCroix so I can get that like bubbly, um, kind of like soda-like. So I don't drink sodas at all. Not even the caffeine-free ones. I don't like them. Um, I don't like sugar in my drinks and stuff like that. So this is actually the grapefruit um, LaCroix. Usually I do the peach pear, but they didn't have peach pear. So, um, Tyler got me grapefruit and now I'm obsessed with the grapefruit and actually drank a whole can of it last night by itself. So, um, I just do one can of LaCroix with one fizz stick. Like I said, this is the mango peach. Um, I am obsessed with this. Hi from Puerto Rico. Oh my God. I'm so jealous. Oh, sorry. Now I feel bad. I sent you a text. Hey, Lisa. All right. Don't forget you guys. If you are my preferred client, if you are a perfect client before September 1st, which is the majority of you guys um, who are on here, y'all have free gifts on your account with qualifying orders. So don't miss out on those. Like don't, they're free gifts up to $98 value. Don't, don't miss out on those. So I'm gonna let that kind of set for a second so it doesn't overflow. Um, and then I know I'm gonna get a ton of questions about this. I have this linked above as well. This is from the Living My Best Style um, collab that she did with Pink Lily. And it's actually like a V-neck kind of sweater that's like super flowy and oversized. Um, but I wear it off the shoulder. I have it on with leggings, but I'll show y'all anyways. Um, if I didn't have it on with leggings, <laughs> you could front tuck like this with some like denim and it would be super, super cute. I'm actually going to do a full try on haul with all the stuff that I got from Pink Lily today. Um, this is one of those things, but I had to throw this on because y'all look at how yummy, like, and it's, it's lightweight, but it's got it, but it's got a, it's got like a nice weight to it, if that makes sense. So it's super, super comfy. I did get a medium in this, but I went ahead and linked it above for you guys. Um, and then if y'all order from my affiliate link above, will y'all just send me a message with your order number? I don't need to know the total or what you ordered or anything like that. Just the order number um, because we need to make sure that it is attached to my affiliate link if y'all decide to go shop for this. And then they are having also um, $25 mystery bags, so y'all can go check that out too. So, girl, these leggings have holes in them. <laughs> I wore them out with Elvis this morning and haven't changed. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to get on Facebook Live. I just want a cute shirt. And I'm going to be comfy from the waist down. And that's how it's going to be. So these leggings are actually from Sparkle Fitness. They are the um, the TikTok anti-cellulite leggings, I think is what they call them. So anyways, um, we are going to do makeup, try to put my life kind of together. We're going to do lashes. We're going to do all the things. Um, so and listen to big loud trucks go back. All right, let me, I gotta have a sip of this, you guys. I can't, I can't go without Fizz anymore. Like, this is it. Like, I'm gonna tell y'all, if y'all have not tried Fizz, mm, so freaking good. All right, so I'm actually gonna do the same base face that I did yesterday, which was the CC cream, you guys, with, <coughs> excuse me, this Redness Rescue Powder, it is so good. I'm going to zoom you on just a little bit. The lighting in here is a little funky because we did just move. I kind of have to get used to new lighting. And my old setup was in front of my window, so I had a little bit of natural lighting as well. Um, this room is more narrow this way, and it's wider this way. So this makes sense for me to be here. 
Hey, Caitlin. Hey, Jacinta. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and go in with this powder before I go in with anything else. I know it seems really weird to put powder underneath your makeup, but if you are oily or red, so whether you struggle from oils, rosacea, um, any sort of redness in your skin, this powder is going to be your best friend. Y'all, I forgot. Yesterday, I said I couldn't find my mirror. I didn't look for it. It's literally been a whirlwind since I got home, y'all. It's been a whirlwind since last Monday when we moved. So, I'm like, I'm still just, I'm so exhausted from all the things. I need all the fizz in my life. So, I'm just going to dust this. I'm going to say press this, but dust this all over. You can kind of see it kind of mattifies me a little bit, but that's what I want with my um, oiliness. I was going to see if I could find my mirror, but the last time I saw it, Sawyer had it, I feel like. That was before I moved. So, is there a mirror over here anywhere? No. Okay, fab. So, I've got to go in search of my mirror because I really have no idea where my big mirror is that sits in front of me. So, we're just going to wing it. All right. I'm going to go in with the CC Creed. CC Creed. CC Cream in the shade Medium. This right here, you guys, is going to be so lightweight. It comes in four different colors. And you can also get the Ready in 5 collection as a preferred client. I think it's only $104. And it's going to get you the CC Cream, the mascara, a brow liner, the blush, and I believe a lip gloss um, for only $104. So it kind of gives you a little, little base face starter kit. And it's such a good deal. So if y'all are interested in that, just shoot me a message and I will be more than happy to help get you color matched. And what I can also do is send you a link over that has everything that we've talked about in it. So all you have to do is scroll through and look at it. And then if there's something you want to add, you just send me a message. If there's something you want to delete, you just send me a message and I'll send you a new link. So this is the CC cream on one side. This is nothing on this side. So this is filter free. You can see it does add a little bit of a glow to my skin, which you guys... I've shared this with y'all before. I'm super, super oily, and the skincare that I used to use made me way more oily than I used to be, like way more oily. And so now that I am all Arbonne skincare, which is clean, toxic-free, and all of that, my oils have kind of like settled a little bit, and I'm not near as oily as I used to be. However, now that I have like good skin, I appreciate a good glow to my skin. So I used to wear like thick and heavy makeup, you guys, all like mattified and there was no shine to my skin whatsoever. And now I like glow to my skin. I feel weird if I look completely like matte and just, ugh, I don't like it. I don't like it. So I do love the CC cream for that. It adds such a nice natural glow to my skin. And you can also wear this underneath the foundation. If you like the color of the foundation, and the coverage that it gives you, you can also put a little bit of this in your foundation and kind of make it a little bit more dewy if you prefer more of a dewy finish to your makeup. So let's see, we're gonna blend. I don't even have a mirror, I don't know what to do with myself. I'm literally using the phone as my mirror. This is like the weirdest, weirdest thing. I am gonna go ahead, well I was gonna, here it is, um, and pop on some lip oil. This is the Arbonne Lip Oil in the shade Lychee. This is the clear, and this is going to help soften all the fine lines in your lips, and it's also going to give you more of a natural plump. It's not a lip plumper by any means, but because it goes in, it's got collagen in it, it's going to help naturally plump those lips, which is going to be really, really pretty over time. I'm obsessed with age well. I love my, how my skin looks now. I've gotten so many compliments. Yes, you guys, I had a girl... Um, in Florida with me. She's actually one of my district managers, Amanda, and she messaged me the other day to tell me she got stopped in the grocery store three separate times for her skin. She went out without makeup on and she had three separate people in one shopping trip stop and ask her about her skincare. And she was just, y'all, she's been in the business less than a year and she was using the same skincare I was um, prior. And it's literally life-changing. Like, I use the word game changer a lot, but it's really life changing. And I mean that wholeheartedly. Like that's, that's what Arbonne has done for me. Product wise, business wise, everything. Like I am full fledged Arbonne in every aspect of my life. I told Tyler, 
the other day, maybe it was my mom, I can't remember. I said, when I run out of all my soaps and stuff, cause I've got like so many hand soaps and stuff that I really need to throw away. Um, they're all gonna be Arbonne, like all Arbonne hand soaps. Like I'm so done with all of this toxic crap that's like, ugh. Once you go toxic free, you don't go back. Like it's, you notice such a big difference in everything. So I went in with our concealer in the shade Fair. This is the lightest concealer. And I'm going to blend that out. And if you guys have any questions, all you need to do is message me. Um, I'm not a scary person to talk to, I promise. And then also what we can do is I can also send you that cart to have you look at it. But once you um, register as a preferred client, there's something called personal shopper where all you have to do is send me a message that says like, Hey Sydney, I need restocks on protein. I need two chocolate, one vanilla. I need four boxes of fizz and I need redness rescue powder. I'm like, cool, great. And so what I'll do is I'll go into my office, my account. I'll log into your account under personal shopper and I will place that order on your behalf. It is the easiest thing you guys, you could literally be out at a coffee shop and like, we're infamous. I'm sure y'all seen us Arbon girls for taking like our fizz with us. We'll order like a refresher and pop a fizz in there or we'll be at a you know restaurant. We'll pop a fizz in our water. Um, you may be out and about and realize, oh my gosh, you only have one of your favorite fizz sticks left. You can message me from the restaurant and be like, hey, Sydney, I need you to order me three boxes of pomegranate fizz. I'm like, cool on it. Great. And usually I can do it right the minute that you tell me. So um, don't ever hesitate to take advantage of that feature because that is at your disposal as a preferred client. So I'm at your disposal as a preferred client. So, <laughs> all right. So this is concealer and CC cream. How freaking beautiful is this, you guys? A CC cream. My skin is so plump and so pretty. I, I love it. I love it. It's so, so good. So, so good. So also, I think I said this already, but I'm probably gonna remind you 17 times while we're live. If you are a preferred client, you do get free a free gift from corporate this month. So make sure, corporate, I don't like saying the word, it's home office. Um, make sure that you take advantage of that, you guys. Don't leave free gifts on the counter. And if you don't know what to get, message me. It's with a qualifying order. So just order your restocks or just message me and I can place the order for you. However you choose. All right, I'm going in with the Got You Covered powder in the shade Ivory. Um, because I am a little more oily, I do prefer this in the summer. And I don't know about the winter yet. I didn't discover this until the summer, so I'm not quite sure how I'm gonna feel about it in the winter time. But I was using the um, Setting Pretty Translucent Setting Powder, and that was just too shiny for me for the summer months. So um, we just switched up to the Got You Covered powder in the shade Ivory, which is the lightest shade. And I'm just dipping it right in to that little, there's like a mesh netting. And it's not a bad mesh netting. There was a product I used in the past that had a mesh netting and it was awful and you could never get the product out. This is actually legit. Like you can get the product out without making a mess. So I really appreciate that. All right. So we are good and set. I freaking love this product, you guys. Oh, so good. So don't forget, you guys can get the CC cream, the mascara, a lip gloss, a blush, and a brow pencil for only 104 bucks as a preferred client. It's a great gift for somebody. You could also grab that and do five separate small gifts. You could literally, or you can treat yourself, you know, <laughs> whatever your heart desires, whatever your heart desires. All right, let's go and set our entire face. We're gonna go in with the pressed powder in the shade tan. And I'm just gonna press this in. Now this brush is from Target. It is the best $10 you will ever spend. You don't need expensive tools all the time. There are some tools that I do like that I did pay a pretty penny for, but this is one of those that I'm like, you know what, it's $10. There's a one that It Cosmetics makes that's very, very similar that is like three times the price of this, probably actually four times, four times the price of this. So go snag this. It's such a good, such a good powder brush. And all I do is press this into my skin. My skin, y'all, holy crap. I'm not gonna lie. For having just gotten back from travel, my skin looks good. Usually when I, when I get home, my skin doesn't look super, super great, but it looks, we're, we're looking good. We're, we're doing well today. All right, let's go ahead and bronze really quick. We're gonna pop on this bronzer right here and do this. Now, um, I do also want to let you guys know, I am hosting a Discover Arbonne event tomorrow night at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So. 
If Arbonne has ever been something you have been interested in, or maybe you're just nosy and you want to know more about what I do, that call is going to be for you. I can't decide if I'm going to do it on this page or my personal Facebook page yet, but I will advertise it as soon as I know. So um, I've already posted about it in my story. So if you guys are interested, just let me know so I can make sure that you don't miss out on that. Um, you guys can ask questions. We're going to go over the compensation plan, how we get paid, why I think this business needs to be in everybody's homes, all of that good stuff. So if you've ever wondered, you just want to learn more about the business and what I do, um, we're going to be talking all things Arbonne tomorrow night at 8 p.m. And I cannot wait. I looked at my local Target and I couldn't find it, but it's Sonia Kashuk. Um, it's there. And I will say at my Target, which before I moved my local Target at the time, was always sold out. They never had this brush. So it's, it's that good. You may have to order it. All right. I'm going to grab our, maybe, our glow palette really quick. Hey, Brianna. Hey, Tanya. And I'm going to grab the shade Meteor, which is right here. And I'm going to do a little bit of a contour. I am going to do something with my hair today. Um, I washed it and let it air dry last night. Oh, 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 oh. I need to tell y'all if y'all missed my post. Hey, girl. Hold up. I, I got to take a break for a minute. Because this is like big, big dang deal. Okay, so you see this 7-in-1 curling wand that I have right here? Let me show y'all my mismatched outfit again. Um, This one right here. Oh, that's going to fall, isn't it? If something all, if it all comes tumbling down, it's fine. This one right here, with my exclusive link, you guys, this $300 tool is on sale for $99. Today only. Only 300 units are discounted. So if y'all are wanting this for $99, send me a message right now or go to the link in my bio either way, my Foxy Bay link, and you'll be able to get this for $99. Don't miss out on that, you guys. It's such a good tool. It's actually the exact tool that I took to um, Nashville and Siesta with me. I took the um, two of the two of the different barrels with me from that tool. So I can actually, I wonder, can I go ahead and post? I don't know if y'all can click on a link if I post it in the comments. Let me go ahead and do it though. Um, thank you, Tanya. I just saw your comment from earlier. Sorry. Or maybe I already said thank you and I'm losing my mind. That could be it too. Um, Let's see if it worked. Okay, I did post the link. It It's clickable on my computer, so hopefully it's clickable on here for you guys. Um, but that tool is only 99 bucks. It's such a good deal, so don't miss out on that. If you've been eyeing that tool, it's a $300 value for only $99 right now. So good. All right, so we're gonna go in with this blush in the shade Fig. This has been my go-to. I love this blush so much. So, so much. And I'm just pressing, and I am being a little heavier handed because I love that blush. And then we're gonna blend it out really, really well. This is a real Techniques Duo Fiber face brush. I love this brush. It came from, I don't know, CVS or Target, something like that. And I, I love it. It's just such a nice, such a nice blending brush. All right, let's do something with these eyes. I think I'm gonna be a little bit more dramatic today. I'm feeling it. So I'm gonna go in with our It's All in the Eyes Volume 1 palette. You guys, I love this palette. Can you tell? It was funny. I was with Adrienne this weekend and I was like, oh, you had a new Volume 1 palette. And she's like, no, this is my original. And I was like, what? She was like, yeah, I just never wear eyeshadow. I always wear bronzer. And I'm like, like I was, I was so blown away because literally all of her shadows are so clean and so intact. And mine, you can tell, like, we love them. We love them. All right, let's go ahead and do this. We're just going to have a little fun. I think I'm going to use the green in there today. So I'm going to use those two shades in the middle called Sand and Caraway. I bronzed my nose really, really good today. Yes, that's what I think we're going to use. I think it'll look nice. I think it will look nice. So we're going to go back and forth. And you guys, this palette is on sale always for preferred clients. So remember, as a preferred client, you pay $29 a year. And that's it. And you get to shop between 20 and 40% off the entire year. It's just like a Sam's Club membership or a Costco membership, things like that. Um, it's not any auto bills or auto ships. It's truly like a Sam's Club or um, what did I say? BJ's, Costco, all that. Hey, Taylor. Yes, girl. 
going with the copper. It's going to be so nice. Do I have a little bump in my brow or something? I feel like there's something right here that is a little sensitive. You know what I mean? When you get bumps in your brow, I think that's like the worst kind of breakout you can get. Like the most painful. You know what I mean? All right. Let's go in with this little fluffy brush. And we're going to grab the shade um, Clove. So we're going to start with this. And I'm going to pop it in the outer corner. So this is really similar to the sweater I have on. I think this sweater, y'all, comes in three different colors. I think I'm going to end up having to go back and order all three colors. Like, I love this sweater. I expected it to be more lightweight. And then when I picked it up, I was like, oh, it's got a good weight to it. But it's not hot, if that makes sense. Like, I'm hot nature and I have to be careful with sweaters. I'm not a big sweater fan, to be honest. And recently, with Pink Lily coming out with all these sweaters, I put them on and I'm like, oh, okay. They do make sweaters for hot natured people. So we can still be cute and trendy. Because usually, y'all, I literally wear, like, not cute sweaters because I can't wear sweaters because I'm I get hot. Pink Lily has solved all my problems with that. But I did link this sweater above for you guys, and you can grab any of the colors above. But if y'all do, if y'all would not mind shooting me a message with your order number, I would greatly, greatly appreciate it. All right. I'm just going to buff out those edges like so. Oh, so pretty. Do y'all see? This is not a lip plumper by any means, but I'm telling you guys, this lip oil does something magical. Like... This is, I did not put on, for the record, did not put on the box. I mean, you can tell how empty it is. It really needs to be thrown away. Um, this right here. I'm telling y'all, let me just move it over here because she's going to be used a lot. I mean, she is used a lot in general, but we're about to amp her use up a little bit. All right. I'm going to grab this little concealer brush that I love dearly. And am I out of setting spray, sweet Jesus? Tell me no. Do I not have a backup anywhere? Oh, man. I might have to just wet my brush with water. This is going to be sad. I thought I had a backup somewhere over the rainbow. I feel like there was one in my kitchen. Like, is this whatever size? This is a medium. So I have it tucked into my leggings, but let me untuck it. This is a medium. And I, let me put it on like how you would wear it if it were not off the shoulder. So this is how with my leggings, super attractive, right? Um, but yeah, this is, I would say, I would say more true to size. I wouldn't say it were sized. I'm gonna pull my leggings up. Okay, let me see. I got up to see if there was setting spray. There's not. Y'all, I haven't done my makeup without setting spray on my eyes at all. Do I not have any? Let me look right here. This is the one part about moving, like, I have, so, I have so many like odds and ends that I literally just start throwing things places and I pray like, I pray they made their way here, you know? Okay, so we're gonna do this without setting spray, I guess. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. All right, let me look at this really quickly. Okay, I'm gonna take, we're just gonna go ahead and do this, we're gonna wing it. Um, we're going to grab the shade Forest. I'm actually going to blow it off and take my finger and just take like the top little layer off just because I don't use it often and some of the kick up from the other shadows may be on it. So this is going to be more of a satin. It's not a shimmer. It's a satin. So I am going to, this is so weird. I usually spray my brush when I use this, but you guys look at the color payoff, even with not spraying it. Like... This is nice. So I'm gonna put this all over my lid. And it doesn't have to be too, too perfect because we will blend it out, but try not to make too much of a mess with it. And keep it on your lid and below that crease. Taylor, you'll be in love with this sweater if you get it. I almost got it in the other color. There was like a a green. Actually, it's like the color of this eyeshadow. This sweater comes in a green. It's so beautiful. So beautiful. Look how pretty that is. Oh, I'm here for this. Yes, girl. Just get the palette. Listen, you can't go wrong with this palette. Send me a message. I'll send you a link with the palette. We got you. It's 
so pretty. Everybody needs this palette. So nice. All right, I'm gonna take this brush with nothing else on it, no additional product, and just buff out those edges. It's so pretty. I really wish I could wet my brush. I could get up and go put water on it, but it's just not the same. I know I have a setting spray around here somewhere. If you spray it with a setting spray, spray your brush before you go in, it will brighten it up a little bit. But honestly, I'm not mad about the way this looks right now. It's very soft. Can I hear people outside? Is that not crazy? All right. I'm going to do just a little bit of this shade right here, which is called Cypress. Just, I'm talking the tiniest little bit. And then we're gonna buff that out with that same fluffy brush. This is so pretty. Glad we did this, glad we did this. And then we're gonna buff all up here. And out here and everywhere. That's pretty. Y'all, and this is CC cream coverage. I'm here for this. I'm here for this. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and take that MAC 212. This is a flat definer. And we're gonna pop this on underneath. I literally have had construction working, smashing and digging pavement outside. Oh gosh, that's the worst. So we are one road back from the main road which means our road is like a secondary road. And I've, I've learned the past, well, mainly just yesterday because I've not been here, um, how busy this road gets <laughs> and how loud it gets. I'm like, oh, okay. Which is fine because I used to live on a super busy road um, where I lived before, but which is kind of funny. It's so pretty, y'all. I love this. I think it's so nice. And as much as I'm so used to wetting my brush and using that green, I kind of don't mind the softness of it not wet. You know what I mean? I don't mind it. I don't mind it at all. Okay, let's go ahead and pop on some liner. I'm going to go in with our pencil liner in the shade Carbon. Um, That was Cypress and Clove. And now I'm going in with Carbon. And doing my water line. I just realized I didn't finish saying what I was saying. And then if you wanted to keep this a little softer, you could use the dark um, brown. I cannot remember what it is to save my life because I always get the black. And I never order the dark brown. But that is super, super pretty. And then we're going to go in with a liquid liner. To be honest, this is the Tarte um, Double Take. It was sent to me in like a, I think a PR package maybe. Maybe a Pink Lily PR package. Um, and I have it, so I'm using it. I don't have the Arbon one yet, but I figured I had this one, so I'd use it. So it's a liquid liner with a felt tip. So I'm going to go in and line the top. And I'm going to let y'all vote. Do we want to wing with this liner? I think I do. I said I was going to let y'all vote, but I'm going to do it. Oh, I can't see, I can't see. Okay. It's been a hot minute since I've done like a, more of a dramatic little makeup look. It's not the wing I wanted, but we got it. All right. And it's kind of hard to see in here, so I'm learning with the blinds open because I've got light coming from one side and straight on and then none from the other side. 
to learn all the new spaces and angles to work with, that's for sure. All right, get this out of my hair. And finish this wing. I will say this does make a nice wing. And I'll just kind of clean up the sides a little bit. Okay. Brianna, girl, I can't see worth a dang right now. I'm not even going to lie. Like, I've got the blinds open because I needed a little bit more light in the room because it just didn't look right. And then now that I'm trying to do it, when I put my hand up, it creates shadows. I'm, like, trying so hard to get it halfway decent. I don't know if I just messed it up even more or what I did, but I think I'm going to leave it alone. I think I'm going to leave it alone. <laughs> I think it's good enough. <laughs> good enough for now as I go back. Yeah. yeah, I just, I needed that. That's what I needed. Yeah, there we go. Okay, we're going to, we're going to stop touching it now. But I think, I think we needed that. And then what I'm going to do is actually go back in. If I ever do liner on the outer corner heavy, I always like to take my pencil again and go back in and dust that in my actual lash line and not just on my waterline, right just on that outer corner. And then we're going to buff it out so it really kind of gets that little cat eye shape a little heavier. One of my favorite little things to do. And we are going to buff only on the outer corner and then with whatever's left we'll take it to the inner corner yeah that's pretty that's really pretty and y'all this makeup looks so freaking good and to believe it's cruelty free toxic free and vegan and it looks this damn good mm -hmm. i'm here for it totally here for it all right, let's go ahead and do our brows. We're going in with the Arvon Brow Pencil in the shade Medium. Um, I used to use the shade Light, but now that my roots are so dark, I swapped it to Medium. And I don't know when I'm going to get my hair done next. I, I was supposed to get it done a couple weeks ago, and I moved my hair appointment just because we were moving and I didn't have time. And now I really don't mind my roots. So, but like it's gonna get to a point where I have to get it done. So I've gotta kinda of get my life together on that pretty soon, actually. All right, hey Kaylee. I love this brow pencil so much. I really didn't expect to like it, to be honest with you. I really didn't. But I do, and I love it so much. All right, let's go in with this one. And then brush downwards. And really work on that arch a little bit. I love the roots in the darker color on you, especially with fall. Yes, I think what I'm gonna do is I, I need my hair re-highlighted for sure. Like it's it's a little brassy in some spots, you can kind of tell. Um, but I think I'm just gonna bring my highlights up a little bit, but not all the way to my roots. So more of like a true balayage. Which I balayage my hair every single time anyways, but it's usually to the root. So we'll see. Who knows? But I'll always be a blonde. Forever and ever. Amen. All right. Let's go ahead and dust away any excess. I mean, I can't get over the way my skin looks with this daggum CC cream. It's so freaking beautiful. It's so pretty. All right, let's go ahead and highlight. Y'all know this is like one of my favorite things to do ever. And there will never be another highlight that I love until Arvon comes out with another one because I love this. The consistency of it, the, the shine, it does not accentuate texture on your skin. If you've got any texture or any breakouts happening, you don't have to worry about it grabbing onto those areas and making it worse, which I love um, because some, some just... Ugh, they, they don't they don't do you any favors that's for sure a 
Look at that. Oh my word. I should have done a before and after on a reel, but I forgot. Been a little flustered today. My skin is horrible from mask wearing all day breakouts. Oh girl, you need clear future in your life. You need clear future in your life. I'm grateful that I don't have to wear a mask every day, but clear future, I'm telling you. Trust me when I tell you. Clear future from Arbonne. It's like, I don't know, I think the most affordable skincare line we have and it clears up your breakouts. It's so, so good. So, so good. Okay. What are we gonna do next? What are we gonna do next? <laughs> Let's go ahead and pop on some mascara really quick. Yes, send me a message. We can chat because I'll be honest with you guys. I, and y'all know, if y'all follow me on Instagram, it, okay, first off, if you don't, I highly recommend it. And I'm not saying that to get followers, but because that is where I am the most raw, real, and vulnerable with you guys. I break out. I have hormonal breakouts so bad. They're not... I say that to me, they're bad. I know some people have like way worse than I do when it comes to acne, but y'all, I have some big old hormonal breakouts that pop up on my face. So when I tell y'all that you can still have nice, clear skin and be acne prone, it is possible. And usually those two things don't go hand in hand, being acne prone and having nice skin, but you can actually have it. Hey, Crystal, I am. Well, we're moved in. We are in here. Um, there's still, you know, I'm sure y'all have moved before you understand. There's things that you don't think about. And then all of a sudden you'll be in the middle of doing something. You're like, Hey, I hope that made the move. Like I haven't seen that since we moved or, you know, whatever. But also we moved in on Monday. I flew out to Florida on Thursday and I just got home on Sunday. So I've only been in this apartment four days. So it's kind of crazy. Four days three days, something like that. So it's kind of crazy, but we're here. I still actually have trash bags sitting next to me with pillows in them that I don't want to put on the couch because I think Elvis will eat them. Um, so, you know, there's little things here and there, but yes, we are moved in. We are living here. We love it so far. Everybody we've met here has been so kind and so sweet. Um, I, I, I love it here. Definitely, definitely love it here. If you're local to me, um, it's, 10 out of 10 recommends so far. Of course, you know, we haven't really had anything bad happen yet, but not to say anything. I mean, nothing bad happened at the last place I lived at, and I would recommend that time and time again. The people were so, so great. When I went and left, every, like, I don't know, every maybe once a month, they would come out to the pool and walk around with a bag of, like, beer or Trulies and just pass them out to the residents. And so when I went to leave, they were like, well, who's, who's going to bring you Trulies at the pool now? They were trying to, like, guilt trip me. I was like, listen, I know. I know. I felt really bad. Elvis is so darn cute. How does Nala like him? So Nala's not here. <laughs> um, the story of Nala continues. So y'all know my mom took Nala when two years ago when I had kidney stones and she's just kept her. It's, it's worked out. Nala's happy living in the woods with my mom. She can open the door and let Nala run and live her best life and she doesn't have to worry about being put on a leash or anything like that. It's great. Um, but... I don't know if y'all saw, and some of y'all, Facebook and Instagram have been weird, y'all. So some of y'all have probably missed a lot of my posts and things like that. But um, my mom got a new puppy, and it's actually Nala's little brother from another litter. So it's the exact same parents, but they're two years apart. And like part of me was like, oh, maybe I can bring Nala to the new apartment. And then I was like, no, I can't take her away from that puppy. She loves that puppy. So Nala is still with mom, and Nala and Elvis have not, well, actually, they technically have met through the window and Nala was not a fan. Um, we went to see Tyler and Elvis one night at work and put Nala in the car with us and the whole time she just barked and barked and barked. I think if she could get out and like actually see him, she would have been fine. But, um, so it's just Elvis here right now and Tyler actually has a golden retriever <laughs> that's at his parents right now. Um, that is supposed to come here, but we're not quite sure how we're gonna make that work yet. So between the three of us, we have three dogs, or between the two of us, we have three dogs that my mom have, they've totally taken over Nala. So really, it's just, just Elvis right now. So yeah, it's, it's fun. Elvis is sweet though. I mean, he's, he's a peach. Um, Danielle, I'll text you. I've not even said like what city I'm in yet at all. <laughs> um, it'll eventually come out, I think, but. I'm kind of just enjoying where I'm at, not sharing, you know, but I'm closer to home. A lot of y'all have called on to where I am, but 
if you're local to me. Okay, um, I'm gonna go ahead and do lashes. Um, what kind of lashes do y'all think we should do? I think we should kind of go big. I'm feeling like either these or not those. I mean, those are big, big, but like I'm digging out two pairs for y'all to compare them to. Thank you, Brianna. You're so sweet. We, we love it. We're, we're happy. It's, you know, we're super close to where Tyler works. Actually, we are in the town where Tyler works. So he literally can just get up and go to work. <laughs> it's pretty great. So, oh, sorry, I kicked y'all. All right, let's vote on lashes really, really quick. Hey, Kaylee. So the first pair option is going to be Bombshell. Yes, it is. Um, I had to learn that. I had to learn a little bit more about privacy, but like, it's so hard because some of y'all a lot of y'all have been on this entire social media journey with me for four years and almost four and a half years now. And like, I, like I want to, and then I'm kind of like, you know what, let me just give it a little bit and kind of like live my best life. You know what I mean? So it'll come out. Don't worry. Um, yay, Crystal. I love that. I'm telling you, Foxy is where it's at. I mean, Foxy, <laughs> you don't know how much I love Foxy Bay, but Foxy is where it's at. I love it so much. It's so good. I'm so glad you love it. I'm so, so glad. All right, so we're gonna vote on lashes. Are y'all ready? Bombshell is the first option. These were the ones I was gonna wear. Lux is the second option. I don't know if they're dramatic enough for this. And then Lust, L-U-S-T, is the third option. So I'm gonna hang them, hang, I'm gonna hang them up on the wall. No, I'm not, I'm gonna hold them up. So we've got Bombshell, Lust with a T and Lux. So you guys let me know. Bombshell, Lust, or Lux. I'm not making anybody drunk and dizzy here. Bombshell, Lust, or Lux. Lust, Lust, and Lust. Lust. Lust, Lust, Lust. Crystal says Bombshell. My girl. My girl. Oh, Brianna, Bombshell. Okay, Jay. Hey, Chasey, I didn't even know you were on. Bombshell. Oh, we got a Lux coming in with Tanya. I love when y'all interact with me. It makes me so happy. Y'all have no idea. I get on here to hang out with you guys. It's really why I do it. My internet friends. Lux, Bombshell. Bomb okay, so is Lust still winning? Lust has three, Bombshell has three, and Lux has one. So we need some tiebreakers on Bombshell and Lust. Bombshell is right here. Lust is on the bottom. Bombshell and Lust. You guys vote. Vote below. Amber coming in with a tiebreaker. Love that. Love that. All right. Lust for the win. Oh, I did get a new um, liquid liner. Hallelujah praise because y'all, mine is nasty. She's gross. Like she is Gross, gross, gross. Um, let's see. I need to stop. I need to, I get emails and then I see something. I'm like, oh, can I tell them about that? And I'm like, no, I can't. Okay, so I'm gonna get the liquid magnetic eyeliner out. This is um, the same as where is my liner? This one. So this is the same thing. Y'all know I we we Glamnetic has the felt tip pens. I prefer this one now. If you're someone who is not like very liner savvy, there's two ways we can change that. You can do what I did and you can go ahead and pre-line and then all you have to do is trace with the liquid liner or you can, Jessica says lust, perfect. Um, or you can get the felt tip pen and use it that way. But, oh, they repackaged. Okay, Glamnetic, here for this. Can y'all tell which one's the old one? It's like gross. And this is the new one. I'm loving this new packaging, by the way. I got nails from Glamnetic that we're gonna try on in a couple of days. I got a whole stack of nails that we're gonna try. Um, we've got the coffin, or no, these are the almond, and then I've got three coffin styles as well. So we're gonna we're gonna be trying those out. But you guys can shake, save fifteen percent on the entire site all the time with my first name Sydney. So don't forget that either, you guys. Don't forget to save money, like. 
I had one girl message me. She ordered, I don't know, three or four pairs of lashes. And then she sent me a message and she was like, oh my Lord, I totally forgot to use your coupon code. And I was like, I feel so bad. Like 15% off, that would have been a big order. All right, so here's the, here's the best thing ever for me. Actually, before we do this, I'm first off, I'm so glad I have a new eyeliner. That's so satisfying. Um, I'm gonna look at the lashes and see if there's any old liner that needs to come off. You wanna make sure that your magnets are clean and clear before you apply them. Otherwise, they're not gonna give you a solid hold. And that's when you're gonna notice things like pop-offs and things like that because you wanna make sure that the new liner can adhere to the magnet all the way. So you can use your nails. Sometimes I use tweezers because my nails get into the way because they're too big. Um, and you can just kind of pinch it off and it comes right off. Hey, Barbara. So, okay, so that one looks good. Let's look at the second one. I try to do this beforehand. I could do it after, doesn't really matter. Um, you really should do it right when you take them off, to be honest with you. That's like the perfect time to do it, but usually when I take them off, I'm like, I'm done. I'm ready for bed. I'm ready to go. Just call it a day. All right. Cool. So we are good to go. So I've got two lashes clean and clear. We're going to go in with the new liner. Do I think Arvon will come out with a pumpkin protein for the fall? Listen, two years ago, three years ago we came out with a pumpkin spice protein and I would give anything to have that back. Like anything to have it back. Now, one thing you can do is do two scoops of vanilla protein. I love our vanilla protein. One scoop of pumpkin puree and you can do a dash of pumpkin pie spice or a dash of cinnamon. I like the pumpkin pie spice because I think it needs a little bit of clove with that pumpkin puree. You got you a pumpkin pie or uh, protein shake. I love our protein, you guys. It's so freaking good. Like, I, that's all I eat for breakfast now. And I get, I remember I got so mad at the airport on the way to Siesta. Oh, because um, all the, the, some of the restaurants are still closed in the airport because they can't get help to open them back up, you know? And so I went to the one, the only one that was open in my terminal. And all they had on the menu was eggs and French toast. There was three different egg dishes and French toast. And eggs make me sick. So I was like, great. Either I get sick or I bloat really, really bad from the gluten in the French toast. And have a really incredibly high sugar. I guess we're going for the bloating and the high sugar. And all I thought of was I should have bought the 10-pack protein shake. Like the little individual protein shakes. And brought them with me to the airport. Because I was not very happy. At all. Oh my God, this is so nice to have a new liner. All right, so what I'm doing now is I'm just tracing the liner that I have down and that's it. So I don't have to worry about drawing a perfect little line or whatever. And then we're gonna let it set for a second. And, ooh, that email. Okay, y'all, if y'all worked with me, if y'all were like a fly on the wall in here some days, y'all be like, sweet Jesus, bless her heart. Like, mm. Also, the tart cherry fizz that comes out on Black Friday, I got to try this weekend in Siesta. Y'all, I hate cherry. I hate cherry everything. I'm not a cherry fan. I loved it. Like, all of us, there's a video of it. I need to get it from Jess. All of us um, tried this fizz at the same time. None of us, even Jess had never tried it. And we were all like, oh my word, this is the best thing we've ever put into our mouths. Like, tart cherry, y'all get ready for it. It comes out Black Friday. So good. I don't know what else comes out Black Friday yet. That's all I know about. I don't know if that's the only thing, but y'all get ready because it's going to be good. All right, so all I'm going to do is set the lash down on my lash line. And if for some reason it's not sticking somewhere, it's probably because you didn't put liner there. Um, sometimes it's kind of hard to see if you did or did not. So, especially if you have nails like I do. So, we're just going to pop it on. And I think I need to squeeze this down a little bit. You know what? This is what I like about them. I can take them completely off and pop them right back on without 
ruining my makeup or having to start back all over. So what I did is I did not put enough on this outer corner. I can feel it. So I'm going to go back in with that same liner and make sure it's right along that lash line all the way to that outer corner. I'm just, we're going to go ahead and do a second coat over here just to be safe. And I always recommend doing two coats anyways. just like that. And then we'll let it sit for a couple seconds before we pop it back on. Hey, Patty. Okay. And then we need to get ready to do a lip combo. I'm going to do a fall lip if I can find it. Now that I say that, I realize I don't see Redwood in my possession, which is awfully confusing to me. Unless it's in my bag. I may go grab my bag really quick. I feel like I want it. I love Redwood. I don't understand where it's at. Um, I could use Willow, I guess. Oh, ooh, ooh. we could use Tara. Mm, that would be too dark. I don't know. I really wanted Redwood. We'll, we'll think about it in a minute. Okay, let's go ahead and pop these lashes on. That that just broke. Oh, great. It's the little push button on my bronzer. All right. That's what you get when you have the same bronzer for almost a year. That's how long they last, you guys. Literally, I joined Arbonne in November of last year, and that's when I got this bronzer. And I still have plenty, and I do my makeup literally almost every day. I'm just going to use my tweezers. We're going to pop it on and pull it on top of my lashes and set her right down. And we have lashes. How beautiful. Gosh darn. And then what you want to do is make sure that they're as close to your lashes, your natural lashes as possible so that you don't have any gaps or anything like that. So I've got a little gap over here. So I just kind of pinch it to make sure that it is as close as possible. These are beautiful. I'm obsessed with these. They're so, so pretty. I love these so much. Okay, lips. You guys, I cannot believe I can't find that dadgum lipstick. Let me go grab my bags really quick because I think it'll be super pretty. Okay. Elvis didn't like me coming out there and him not being allowed to come in here. Okay, I'm hoping I put Redwood in here when I traveled. We even talked about, I don't even think, now that I'm thinking out loud, I don't even think I took it with me. I got skin elixirs out the rear end here. And some antioxidant shots. Literally, I got everything Arvon in this bag. There's only one other place I could think it would be, and I'm not going to sit on here and walk around my house and look for it. So, we'll just wing it. Um, we'll do another dark lip color. So, let's go in with the lip liner in the shade. What is this? Morel. It's an eyeliner as a lip liner. And we're going to overline just a little bit. that oh gosh I'm, I'm about to be obsessed so I just know it and we're gonna grab the shade Tara so this is a darker color for fall it's so pretty I haven't worn it but once I think maybe twice look at that 
Uh -huh. Oh, sweet baby Jesus. I am here for this. Everything about this, I am here for. Like, oh, give me a latte and some hay bales and a fire. Holy crap. Oh, yeah. Yes, ma'am. What's that song? I understood the assignment. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I sure did. That was, this is phenomenal. This, this is everything about this, this shirt, this lip, this eye color, this messy bun that's fallen out. Like, I'm here for it. I am here for this. Like, I'm here for it. I can't believe I broke my bronzer, but I'm here for it. Oh, I love this so much. All right, you guys, we are done. I'm going to hop off. If you guys have any questions, please send me a message. I know some of us chatted about skincare earlier, so send me a message. Um, we will take a look at everything. We'll send you some options and figure all of that out. Other than that, I'm going to hop off here, and I'll see you guys later. Bye, y'all.